You're an invasive species. That's you right. You know what their will is. You're talking shit. Oh, fuck. You're so that's a disgrace? Wackers. How am I, Wackers? How am I, Wackers? Such a stigma with this animal rights thing. Like, yeah. you guys are pretty fucking hardcore. What type of defense would you want if you were enslaved against your will, being raped, and then gonna be murdered? How's that going? Are you next? No, 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 no. I just huh? wanna say, regardless of my position, I, I believe you argue very respectfully. Thank you. Time. Thank you, mate. Um, Appreciate you know, it. I, I see what you're saying, whether yeah. or not my choice is my choice, but I think you're one of few activists that actually argue. Yeah, logically. Well, logically and very respectful way. Yeah. So, okay, I appreciate that. So, so certainly, certainly appreciate that. Concept. No, no worries, mate. What's your name? Right, Troy, brother. Troy, I'm Joey Nossley. I do watch your videos on YouTube. Yeah, you do? <laughs> but I'm a farmer boy from way back. Oh, yeah? You've got me cutting down. Yeah. But You're a farmer boy? Yeah. Well, for animal farming, you mean? Yeah, from okay. Way back. My grandfather's stock up carrier. I understand the tradition behind it. But I really respect the way that you respect the people that you have a conversation with or a debate with. Oh, no, no worries. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that, mate. Thank you. Hello, what's your name? Hey, Alice. Hello, Alice. Don't be shy, I'm, I don't bite. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so you, you've seen this, hey? Yeah. Tell me more, I literally had no idea this was happening. Okay, so this is the female. What he's, the reason he's got his hand in the, that hole where the poo comes out yeah. is because he's, they're taking the poo out to hold her by the cervix so they can insert the pipette full of bull semen. Yeah. And the way they get this, so they hold him down in a rack so they can't sort of escape. The way they get this is by either this ejaculation method or with an electro ejaculator they stick it in the boy's bottom to get the what it does is see he's trying to escape it sends an electrical pulse into him till he ejaculates these are really young animals and um, that's why I've got a sign up here saying yeah dairy is the rape industry I honestly didn't know that was happening that's insane. do you disagree with yeah absolutely <laughs> you disagree with this but do you agree yeah. with the the sign and what it says uh, yeah, I understand why you've said it. Like, if I was walking along, it caught my eye because I was like, what? Why does, well, yeah, why does that relate to that? But now you've seen the video, like, yeah. Yeah, That's yeah. insane. Because this female animal here, she doesn't give consent for this yeah. person to do that. And really, they're too innocent and to give consent. They yeah, no, consent absolutely. like a small child can't understand. Yeah, well, that is animal abuse, isn't it? <laughs> it's yeah. like no way around that, yeah. That's yeah. And it's the reason they're doing it too. Yeah. They're not doing this to help the animal or put them in, that, so that it's in the animal's best interest. Yeah. They're doing it to exploit them for their milk and their children and yeah. they kill them. Yeah, that's insane. Yeah. For everyone. So, <laughs> what, I, the re, what I do, right, what I do yeah. for a living is I ask the public to boycott these industries. So choose vegan. So one of the 20 plant milks, choose one of them. Yeah. Um, vegan cheeses and just boycott these industries and ask others to do the same. And then what happens to these industries is they go under, Yeah. you know? I think it's just a lack of awareness, isn't it? Like a lot of people don't even know this is happening or like choose to ignore that it's happening because it's such an uncomfortable topic to talk about. People but, yeah. are calling me perverted for showing this, showing them how really? their milk is made. That's just ignorance, isn't and it? And I'm against just, it. Like, I'm trying to, yeah. No, that's just ignorance. That's people not wanting to know so that they don't have to change their habits. It's like, easier to <laughs> attack the messenger than... Oh, yeah, absolutely. Yeah, like, people were just yelling abuse at you down the street. I was like, what the hell? Yeah, someone was <laughs> going to stab me before. Yeah. For sticking up for animals. That's mental. Yeah. Absolutely mental. Yeah. So, do you think that you can consume... You know, a, a supply and demand chain, you pay for this yeah, to happen. Yeah. If you consume any dairy product or any animal product, you pay for them to be exploited and killed, basically. Yeah. So... Would you boycott it knowing all this? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, turning my head. Yeah. yeah. That's crazy. No, good on you guys. Good yeah, on you guys. It. There's a good website called Challenge 22. Okay. And you can just do a little vegan challenge. They help you out at the start. Yeah. But it, like veganism is not a diet. It's a moral stance yeah. against animal exploitation. So it's something that you do for life. Yeah. You're either for animal cruelty or you're against animal cruelty. And vegans just act in a way that's consistent with their belief on, on animal cruelty. It's definitely getting more common, isn't it? Yeah. Like, I think it's up and coming. I think it's going to be the way forward. Awareness, but yeah. Isn't it? yeah, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. yeah. We get this stuff out crazy. to people and they're like, no thanks. Yeah. Yeah. As soon as people understand and realise. Yeah, because all their children get taken and they take the milk off them. The, the boys get bolt gunned in the head because they don't produce milk. The girls will go on to be forcibly bred, have their children taken, the milk will be taken from them, and then they'll be turned into leather couches and burgers and steaks. No. So true. Thank you for the chat. Nice talking to you, Alice. Take <laughs> Thank care. You. Thanks for sitting down. <laughs> Good luck. You're interested in running a chat?
Yeah. You don't, okay, come and sit down. So, this here, yeah. I'll show you what they're doing. These are bulls. They have this big electric dildo shoved in their ass while they're held down in a rack. Yeah. And then they send a current of electricity into them yeah. until they ejaculate into a cup for them. Yeah. And then, see, so he's trying to escape. Wow. It's not comfortable. Some hardcore shit. Yeah, it's <laughs> fucked up. This is a dairy industry, bro. So then they do that, and then they get that semen. Yeah. And that's a female. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, they stick their fist into their rectum, yeah. pull the poo out, hold their cervix here. Um, and then, see, she's holding, her fist is in the cow's asshole. Yeah. And then she's injecting the bull semen into her, the cow's cervix. See that? The cow's held down in a rack so they don't move. Yeah. And they, do they do this everywhere? This is a standard practice in the dairy industry, yeah. What about, like, why do you think they do that? Oh, I know that, like, can't you just hire bulls, yeah? They do in some cases. They put a, a bull stud in with the... But for the dairy industry, vast majority are artificially inseminated like this. Yeah. So oh. do, do, you, do you agree with the statement on the... Do you agree with the statement on the sign? Yeah, yeah. You agree that it's... That the dairy is the rape industry? It's not the rape industry, but it's definitely got something to do with it. Rape is in the industry. Yeah. <laughs> it's not just to rape. Yeah, it's yeah. obviously they rape for dairy. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah definitely, yeah. man. I just... I don't know, man. Like, I've been thinking about it a lot, like... I get what you're trying to do, but yeah. I don't think you're doing it the right way, man. Yeah. Like, you're getting people to sit down and you're having an argument with them, and yeah. that kind of separates you from them rather than having an honest chat and telling them how you feel but yeah, not I getting into an argument. And maybe, you know, some people won't listen, but some people will walk away. And I get it. Why, why aren't they on my team? Why should it separate us? Because they like their milk. I, ex <laughs> exactly, because they like their milk. So if you're an animal rights person, if you care about this, why aren't you on my side? You know, but like, why are they? No, not you. Hypothetically, like, why are they attacking me if they really are on the side of animal rights? It's such a stigma with this animal rights thing. Like, yeah. you guys are pretty fucking hardcore. Yeah. Like, you guys don't fuck around, and like, you know that all the vegan protests and shit. Like, yeah. that's. Well, let me ask you this: What type of defence would you want if you were enslaved against your will, being raped, and then going to be murdered? Well, what type of what type of defence do you think is justified for that? What type of defence is justified and what type of defence will work are two different things. I think you can achieve a lot with peace and love and understanding, yeah. but if you want to have an argument with someone, they're just going to tell you to get fucked. Not necessarily, and I'm not generally trying to argue. I'm yeah. trying to logically yeah. bring someone to a conclusion. Yeah. Now, if this sign makes people feel a certain way, then why don't they direct their anger towards the people in the dairy industry who are providing them with the product that they want to consume, why are they attacking me? Who's trying to stop this? So, um, I guess if, you, if politics is people are really passionate about politics and religion, you know, they're, they're I'm the, not. you're not. No, I don't no? give a shit about those things. I give a shit about um, if politics take away someone's rights and enslave them and kill them. But here in Australia, we we generally have human rights here. In Australia. Well, we have human rights, legal human rights, protecting children, women. You know, the racism, yeah. like. All of that stuff, if you enslave someone because of the colour of their skin, you're going to go to prison. Yeah. What rights do they have? So, I'm an animal rights person. So as, as me, what can I do to, to, to contribute to this being stopped? Like, what, yeah, well, what can you do? Well, do you pay for these products? No. In, you don't eat the... You drink soy milk? Yeah. yeah. Do you eat meat, dairy, eggs? I, I, I do eat meat, yeah. yeah. So... The meat industry is no better than the dairy industry. They're all being exploited and killed and having their calves taken away and piglets taken and turned into bacon, gas chambered, stabbed to death. The best thing you can do is be a vegan if you, if you want to boycott animal cruelty. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I guess so. It's, it's a big commitment. It's something that me and my mate wanted to do, go yeah. vegan, but it's just so hard, man. Where do you start? Yeah, where the fuck do you start? It's weird, you know what's weird, dude? Like, you didn't come up here and start having a go at me, did you? No. Yeah. No, I'm not so do you think it's me or do you think it's them? It's it's, it's them, it's them. But yeah. so who's the problem here? The farmers. Well, well, it's the consumers that are, are opposing me. You know, why don't they just go? Shit, I didn't know that, bro. Thanks for telling me. Hey, eh? I fucking hate animal cruelty. They like their meat, man. They like their milk. They like their meat. Exactly. And I guess you can only do so much to change that. Yeah. Surely, surely you can get across to some sort of parliament governmental figure who can 
kind of implement some sort of yeah. policy. To so what's he got in his coffee? He's got Hopefully dairy milk. milk. Nah, he's got dairy milk. So they're, they're all, they all don't want to get rid of the uh, animal exploitation industry either. But bro, where you start, right? Challenge, challenge 22 on Facebook, they do like a little 22 day vegan challenge. Yeah, yeah. And then it's just challenge 22, easy to find. And then you can do it with them and they like hook you up with best places to go and yeah, yeah. super easy in it's Melbourne. Like what to cook, man. Yeah. Like food is just, like meat is like... Part of everything. Yeah. Yeah, well, you get mock meats that mimic the same texture and taste, or you can have tofu and beans and rice yeah. and pasta, and there's plenty of foods that are made out of plants exclusively and alternatives that don't involve... How do you feel about eating the murdered flesh of an animal? Circle of life, man. I, I, I believe in that stuff. Like, I think we're doing it too much. Yeah. Like, I wouldn't go vegan because, I don't know, like, I grew up on a farm, I was slaughtered cows I've seen it all happen and it's it's not pretty but people like their meat yeah you know you think because you like meat it justifies the circle of murder no no it doesn't I I think I think it just needs to be minimalized like what about complete do you minimalize bashing your wife or I don't know you probably don't have a wife but do you think if I was beating up my wife or being cruel to my dog you think I should minimalize it or do you think I should just fucking stop it yeah yeah. <laughs> you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, probably Maybe stop should probably stop that. Maybe minimise this. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Why don't we just stop it, dude? Like, any other rights issue, we don't say minimise it. We say, fucking get your hands off of them, stop it, you know? Yeah, man. Yeah. It's a hard one, man. Uh, maybe I'll try Challenge 22. Yeah, yeah, no, definitely will. All right, brother. Take care, mate. Yeah, man, sweet. See you, bud. man. Thank you. Okay, so that was a successful day of outreach. This table actually stimulated some very interesting debates. Very good spot here. And yeah, dairy is the rape industry. So if you're against the rape and exploitation of animals, you should definitely boycott dairy and definitely boycott all animal products. Thank you.